Hey guys, it's Becky. I might, also, I might not look in these days. I found them in my cupboard there, but why not put them on? They, just, they seem too big for my head though. It's the only problem with having a small head. Take these off now. I'm doing my January favourites. I don't think I've done a favourite since November. I don't know. I don't know. I used to do them all the time and then I stopped doing them because I did other videos. I'm hoping this angle and setting on my camera is fine because I messed around with some settings on my camera and it's really gone very light and these aren't in focus anymore so I don't know what I've done but if it looks alright while I'm editing it I will keep it like that and also the natural hair because in the north it's snowing and it's cold and my hair just didn't want to straighten in this morning so enough with the ram can I just start off by saying Oh my god guys, look how many subscribers I've got compared to, if you go from January to now, look how many subscribers I've got. I looked at it today and I was like, what? I just couldn't believe it. I love you guys. Um, the giveaway is coming, I'm going out to buy everything next week. Well, speaking of next week, I'm filming this on a Friday, which is the 30th, which is also Amazing Phil's, uh, Phil Lester's birthday, or Amazing Phil, and um, next Friday will be my birthday. <laughs> As per normal, I will be vlogging my birthday. I'm also vlogging the day before my birthday because I'm going shopping, so uh, expect that vlog sometime when I ed I've edited it. Here is the Makeup Revolution. Lipstick in what's it called? Enchant. Really nice pink. I haven't got it on today. I've got the um what have I got on? The Revlon the Rev Revlon um lip butter in cotton candy. I really like that one as well. And to go over the top of that I normally use this. And this smells so nice. It smells so sweet. But I can't put my finger on it and what sweet it smells like. It smells so nice. I mean, it says it smells like sugar sprinkles, but I don't even know what sugar sprinkles smell like, so I'm like, okay. But it smells really nice. For some reason, whenever I move a product near the camera, like right up close to it, it changes the background for some reason and I have no idea why but this see what I mean? one minute it was white and the next it's got a really pinky colour but we'll just deal with it Um, this is 2 99 and I have it on today I don't really want to not that you'll see because my camera does not pick makeup up and my tripod's very wobbly so I don't want to touch it Um, this is 2 99 and I'd say this is on par with uh, some of the higher end makeup um, mascaras that I've used and this will always be my favorite. This was my go-to mascara for school and I mean after a couple of weeks I did try other ones but I always go back to this one for school because it just gave me the nice big lashes which is what I like because as I've said before I don't like um, false lashes so hair's annoying me so I will always try to create false looking lashes with mascara if you're looking for a cheap but effective mascara, I'd go for the Miss Forty Studio Lash. The light, the light is going to change in this video, I have no idea why. I think it's what I did with my camera. Um, yeah, um, Miss Forty Studio Lash. Uh, I got my first My lash just knocked my tripod over and my camera fell. Thank God it's alright though. Never film when you've got an animal in the room. Um, I got my friend Superdrug uh, for 2 .99. I don't know if they do it in boots. I've never seen Miss Sporty in boots, but I know we just go for Benefit and L'Oreal in boots because I get more points and they're normally on offer. But this Superdrug, 2 .99. If you're looking for a cheap but effective mascara, I definitely try to uh, give this a go. My last uh, makeup favourite. My last makeup favourite, which is making a hell of a lot of night, are my beauty blenders. They came in the post and I'm so happy because if you've watched, because it's rattling, my lows down here, she's, she's getting treats. Um, so if you've watched my, if you watched my um, last video, which is 
the what's in my makeup bag which if you haven't link will be down below um, you will know that my make my beauty blender was disgusting and I mean disgusting um, I get my beauty blender off eBay because the amount of times I go through them I don't want to be spending like five six seven eight quid upwards on a beauty blender because I do use mine every day and I do clean it and everything but eventually they're all gonna go horrible and disgusting like mine did so I get mine off eBay and they're really cheap as well, they're only really like 99p and this time I got two if I can find out where I got mine from I'll link it down below because I stand by beauty blenders I used to use the Real Techniques, it was called the buffing brush um, to put my foundation on but um, I didn't really like the effect it gave me whereas with my beauty, um, beauty blender it gives me a really natural finish and I really really like that not that you can tell in this light because for whatever reason my camera is not picking up my white light <laughs> might <laughs> never play around with your camera if you don't know what the, uh, you're doing with it and my last physical favourite that I can show you are my earphones if you watched my vlogmas vlog I think it was vlogmas day 24 but I might it was either Vlogmas Day 24, it might be Vlogmas Day 24, 25, 26, so I combined quite a lot of them. Um, I got these early because they were supposed to be a Christmas present, but I broke mine with earphones. I have the worst track record with earphones. I don't like the ones that go over your head and have the great big ear things here because I have a small head. So even when I've got them like, as soon, even if I've got them like really stuck to my head, they still fall off. Um, I don't like the ones that actually go in your ear with the little earbud because they hurt my ear. So I have to use these ones. School candy, if I can say it properly. And they just look like that. The black and white. And they are amazing. Like I said, I have an hour's bus journey to work and from work. And it is always really busy. So obviously it's loud because you've got the uh, bus engine and then you've got people talking. And then you've got children crying and all that. that. But... Normally I have to have my iPod on really really loud, but with these I don't, um, which is one, which is so good because one, I protect my ears because I always worry about it when I have my music on really loud, and two, I don't annoy all the other passengers because um, sometimes if I've got music on really loud, I see like older people go, what the hell is she listening to? What is that racket? And I'm like, it's all time low or it's the pub plan or it's uh, you made six, you know. <laughs> I have two food favourites, um, one is my mum's enchiladas, I will see if I can put a picture up, if not I will link my Instagram below and you'll see it on there. And the second one is, you'll see a clip coming across here soon, is um, dairy free brownie uh, cupcakes. Everybody knows I'm lactose intolerant and I hate the stuff for lactose intolerant people. The cheese is disgusting, I don't have the cream, I don't like the soft cheese. The only things I can have is the red milk because I don't like the blue or the green milk and the butter. And um, the dairy free chocolate is disgusting. Basically everything that's dairy free or lactose free is disgusting. Um, I finally found something that I like, it's from the free from range in Tesco, like I say, it'll probably be across here and they are so nice and they're only 70p for two as well which is so cheap Most like dairy are so expensive for, uh, for what they are here, right? My TV favourites for this month are Chicago Fire, of course I've been, I'm halfway through season three um, because I watch it somebody very kindly puts it on YouTube so I don't have to wait until um, it comes on to Sky Living but I'm halfway through Sky, uh, I'm halfway through Chicago Fire Season 3 and re-watching Chicago Fire Season 1 going into Season 2 Kita loves to, uh, Chicago Fire <laughs> uh, Bones because the new season is on and I'm so annoyed that Sweets died I knew he was but I didn't think it would be I mean spoiler alert if you haven't watched it yet I didn't think it would be in the first episode I mean, what a way to start the season off. I was like, no, you cannot kill Sweets off. There's Nigel Vincent Murray. I think that's what he was called. And then Sweets. So annoying. Um, and to go along with that, the new season of NCIS is on. And now, if anybody knows me, I watch NCIS religiously. It's normally on um, 
Universal, uh, Fox and Five USA <laughs> every day and I've, like, I've seen them all thousands of times before. I will sit and watch them. Most of the time I, I sit there and go, well I already know who's done it, but you know. <laughs> but now uh, season 12 of NCIS is on and I'm happy. Though I'm filming this on Friday night and I haven't watched NCIS yet. But I will be doing. And my last TV favourite is that Two Broke Girls is back on. Now, when that first came on, I was like, why on earth would anybody watch that? And I didn't until late at night and I was looking through the channel. So I sat and watched it, didn't know what it was. And I was like, this is actually quite good. And now I absolutely. And I'm going to um, throw Chloe and I to it. Uh, my hoodie. Um, I seem to be wearing this in every. I do have a t shirt on, by the way. Um, I seem to be wearing this in every single video or every single photo. Hoods just don't suit. I could never be a gangster. I mean, hoods just don't suit me. This is my jacket. I got it like, yeah, I'm going to take the hood down now. <laughs> I got it about a year ago or a year and a half ago uh, from, um, from New Look and I really like it. It's not a colour that I would have chosen because I'm a, a black, grey, white kind of girl uh, with a bit of purple thrown in. <laughs> but I actually really like it. It's my go-to jacket all the time. So that is all my favourites. I know this is a really random January favourites, but it's a little bit of everything. Let me know your favourite. Let me know your favourites down below. And um, Bye guys!